The chat doesn't seem to be updating correctly. Fun, fun times. I'm a tired. Oh, I'm a tired. Hang on, let me uh, grab another chat thing. Let me see if this will work. Yeah, it's working on my end. I don't know if it's gonna pick up what you guys are saying. Uh, try, try saying something. Just so I know it's good real quick. Oh wait, did it hide the message? Why did it hide the message? Don't do that. Okay, well, it, it's getting it. I don't want it to hide the messages. And I'm pretty sure I set it to not do that. I mean, it's not a big deal if it does. It's just that I set it to not do that. And I would prefer if it not do that without my permission. Okay, let me say, let me say. We're gonna see. Okay, I think it's that the browser source was refreshing. Okay, checking the delay. There's no delay on my voice. Alright, we should be good to go. Should be good. <clears throat> anyway, so, well, oh, actually, there's one more thing I wanted to, uh, wanted to test. And that's just to make sure that the frame rate's good. Gonna turn the game down a little bit. Tell me if it's too quiet, but uh, it just seemed a little on the loud side. Hmm. It kind of seems a little inconsistent. I don't know. You guys just let me know if it's too loud, but uh, or too quiet. Anyway, I just want to check to make sure the stream looks all right, and then we'll be good to go. Yeah, I'm coming off of a cold here, so a little sniffly, just a little bit. Hang on, I gotta watch a Verizon ad. Don't you just love ads? Okay, gonna run around a second, just make sure that the stream looks nice and tasty. Give it a sec. I'll go over here while I'm doing this. Yeah, yeah looks good to me. So just let me know if the audio is good. And besides that, before you head out, I want to explain a few things. Our button is use center camera. You can use a D-pad to control the, the camera. My controller is tangled up with my headphones. Uh, Oh, you can switch between a smooth camera and an eight-directional camera. So... So basically, this is new camera. And this is, uh, like, Mario 64 camera. Got it. Oh, no, the... The reason that it didn't show up is because I don't think Link is one of my emotes, so it, that's not actually the name of it. Alright, so... Yeah, so you can, like, move it up and down in this. 
same stuff you can do in Mario 64. So basically the story here, I was playing this hack uh, like a, maybe a year or two ago. And the SD card that I had the save files on corrupted before I could finish it. So basically, I figured, you know, I still I still wanted to go through it, so I figured, you know, I'll stream it next time, and that's gonna be how we'll do it. So yeah, let's let's get into it. Okay, so the meteor has fallen, and piranha plants have been summoned into the world. Yeah, that volume... the volume looks a little bit high. I may have overcompensated, let me know. Anyway, we gotta deal with these guys. Give him the old squish. Game's a little loud, in my opinion. Oh, <laughs> good, good. Hitboxes. Thank you, Mario. I feel danger coming. Mario, you have to gather the stars to protect the Mushroom Kingdom. Well, that's our plot. <laughs> it ain't much, but it'll do. Yeah, I'm, I'm way ahead of you there, Toad. Yeah, so this is a hack of Mario 64 by Kaze Emanuar. Got a few... I, you got a few choices. Per level. I'm just trying to get this one up, because Lord knows I'm gonna need it. This is probably the hack that most people know about when it comes to this game. Um, the other one probably being Star Road. You know, I would have streamed Star Road, but I kind of already 100%ed that before I started streaming, so... I mean, I would be down to do it again eventually, but, you know, the guy's working on a quote-unquote remake of the game. So, I don't know. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Yeah, and they got the little previews from Mario Sunshine in here. Alright. First star. Let's go. Got Mario 3D World music. Yeah, uh, this isn't really a blind playthrough, unfortunately, but I don't remember everything, so. There's still gonna be, don't worry, there's still gonna be some tomfoolery. So anyway, you may have noticed in the corner there that I have like a little indicator of what stars I have. And it'll also update in real time to show what items I have. So you can see how many red coins I've collected. Okay. It, it, oh, dang it, I was so close. Doesn't matter, though. And yeah, it updates in real time. Shows you what, like, it even highlights the last star I got. Shows you where I am, like what course I'm in. Pretty, pretty neat. So you can track my progress in real time. Little rabbit lost. Alright. Then a cage. Yeah, if anybody wants to check it out, the program's name is Star Display. You might have to throw, like, Mario 64 in the search engine. 
I almost called it a scoot engine and I'm not entirely sure why that is. Anyway, I'm probably going to be playing a lot of Mario, not, not Mario 64, Nintendo 64 games in the near future. Our son went missing. I bet these tap taps have something to do with that. Can you try and find our son? Now, that's kind of a bold assumption to make. Yeah, so you just gotta trick him into the quick sand. I don't know. Might be quick sand. Yeah, so. So yeah, this hack has a lot of uh, has a lot of new stuff in it. New enemies, we got some new power-ups. Got some new new most things, really. And you know, it may not seem like too over the top right now, but it you know, it'll get there. Oh. Good, good. Oh yeah, and then one of them dropped a key. And we can use that key to do things. We can free the rabbit, which is our goal, our lot in life. I'm gonna try to go for 100% in this, but I don't know. If you guys get bored, then I could probably just, you know do that off screen. We'll, we'll see. We'll see how things go. Thank you. You saved our child. We want you to take the star to show how thankful we are. It's always a star, isn't it? Like... Yeah, one of you already said that. Also, uh... Nobody probably noticed, because nobody here ever uses it, but... The Smash Cast chat has been down for a, a little bit. Because... Yeah, you know, Smash Cast Mirror is down for now, because it won't connect to the chat. But the re the restream... The, the people at restream say they're working on it. I don't think there's any point to being up here, but I did it. I should probably farm uh, that one up on top of the Moai head. Because I'm gonna need, like, it may not seem like much now, but I'm gonna need that later. Like, this, it seems pretty simple, but this hack gets kind of insidious later on. There we go. You know, just looking around here, you got. Like a rocket ship, got like a pier, Lakitu, got Peach's castle, but I don't think you ever go in it. It's just there for, for flavor. Okay, that was something. Just, <laughs> I'm probably not going to do it again, but you know, it was on stream. You all saw it. Let's go back in, into the fray. Up the go up the giant tree. Okay, let's do that. Just make it real quick. We'll go super quick, super fast. Need to adjust the horizon of the camera. Yeah, see, that that is much better. Much easier to see. I mean, it's Mario 64. Let's cut him a break. There's only so much one can do to mitigate the issues. Okay, now, now see, now this is too high. Nope, nope. Whoa, fell down. 
probably gonna be a lot of stick clicking in this, unfortunately. I'd say there's nothing I can do about it, but there's nothing I'm willing to do about it. And just like that, it's as simple as that. I think Mario went into the ground a little bit. There's like a little thing you can do with Joshi here, I think. Hey Mario, I came to find to some yummy stuff to take to our Yoshi Island. Can you help me find some tasty stuff? Just put it in the basket. Well, there's some, like, strangely modeled coconuts right here. Mario Sunshine, it sure ain't. <clears throat> now let's just kind of push... Can't pick it up. Like, don't, don't even ask, because I can't do it. <laughs> Walk up the tree slightly, it's fine. It's no big, no big deal. Just clip, clip on top of the, the podium. Clip through Peach. It's fine, don't worry about it. Just gotta push it into the basket. Oh. Did it, did it go in? Did you get it, Yoshi? You can have the shiny thing I found. Now we're even. Hello, person whose name I cannot pronounce and will not try. You bet. Save all the time, so... Surprisingly, that's the second overworld star and not the first. Ah, oh, dang. Like I said, I'm gonna need these lives for later. I don't need them now. But, er. Kaze knew what he was doing here. Putting it on top of the Moai head. That insidious fiend. Do not consume the fuzzy. Find the lonely Momoki. Alright, I think I know what this is referring to. I think it's referring to, uh... No? No, not what I thought. Oh, no, there he is. Huh? Oh, you found me. You're the first one to talk to me in a long time. Wanna play tag? Yeah. Very challenging game of tag. You caught me. Thanks for playing with me. I want you to take this, friend. <laughs> Big chungus. And we opened up a new level, but we're not done with this one yet. That's the Mario 64 way. Floaty eight coins. Yeah. So this will probably be when I get the 100 coin star as well. And yes, those are still a thing. Wiggler doesn't get mad when you stomp on it. Zero out of ten. Yeah, this was one of my favorite songs in uh, 3D World. Good game, good game. No Odyssey, but it's a good game. 
Oh, hang, 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 hang. Um, no. Gotta do some careful platforming. Maybe not that careful. Okay, now we could get that star. Camera's wigging out just a little bit. Uh, we could get that star. But, I am going to go back down and instead get the 100 coin star first. Shouldn't be too hard in this level. Yahoo! Wahey! Alright, so we could play tag with the monkey, but we're not gonna do that. That's not our mission anymore. don't even know what the hitboxes on these guys are. It's alright. At least for now. Oh, dang it. <laughs> yeah, this... The, the quick sand question mark, uh... Kinda ruins your, your jump. So it's hard to get out when you've gotten in. Goombler. And there we go. Um, that was a bit, a bit of weirdness with the foot there. Just a little bit. This game's got some jank to it. You know, not just Last Impact, but also Mario 64 itself. <laughs> oh. Might as well, you know, get a few more for that sweet and juicy coin high score. And then we don't gotta worry about it. Get over here. These uh these tap taps look a little bit goofy. Just a little bit. No, no, no. Come over here. We're gonna get us a jamboree going. I know that's for scuttle bugs, but. Tap Taps can have a jamboree too, I suppose. Don't need the key. Don't want the key. Alright, last one, and then we'll go... <laughs> okay. Let's go... Go get the red coin star now. This is so much more fun to do in Sunshine. Like just tap B to get everywhere. Here we go. And that's a nice view. Of under the ground there. Oh. Peach. Oh. Peach is gonna die. Plus, getting a whole bunch of coins is just good for lives, which, again, we are going to need. I know it seems silly. You don't believe me now. But we're gonna need them. The moon is getting closer and closer. We need star power to protect ourselves. 
Is this Majora's Mask now? Apparently so. Er, pipe collision. There's, there might be a better way to get this. This is the best way I know of, though. No, I want. I want. There we go. Okay, one last star to get in level one. And it's float through the sky. And I know exactly what to do. Yeah, like I said, a few of these stars I, I remember quite vividly. I thought for sure that would be a ledge grab, but apparently not. Nope. Come back. I need it. There we go. And then you just gotta float through the air, gingerly on a breeze. Um, I beg your pardon. How can I get out of here? Yep, there you go. And that's it. That's it for level one. Now we just gotta move on to two. Tw Not before we do that. Not before we get that one up. Because I'm telling you. I'm telling you, you're tired of hearing it, but it's true. Let me see, is there a better way to get on top of this head? Well, if it is, it ain't that. Hmm, could maybe uh, do a triple jump onto this one. It's just, it's just not an easy one up to get. I'll tell you that much. I will tell you that much. Okay, now we'll go into the actual level. Stone Snatch Snatch Snatters. What was the name of the mission? I already forgot. Okay, go... Spiky Stones. Okay, go into the tent. You might remember that that texture from somewhere. Are you dangerous around here? I'm a scientist and I wanted to inspect that snake statue. Oddly, these rocks started moving it as I got close and got and it scared me away. Statue might hold a secret. Hey, if you could help me getting rid of these rocks, I have a shiny reward for you. Okay, what do I do about this? What do I do about you? That, that's what I do about you.
Okay, so I guess go back to the guy. Well, you got rid of the stones around that snake statue. Thanks for helping me with that. May this be enough to show my gratitude? Wait, hang on. I'm gonna try something. Nope. Ain't enough. It just... T tis just ain't enough. Taint. Taint enough. There we go. D mud for the deity. This is a Mario game, you're not allowed to say that. Um, I beg your pardon? You could probably backwards long jump up this. Yeah, I don't care enough to try anymore. Okay, Mario, come on. Come on, Mayro. Speaking of Mario Sunshine. But, I'm pretty sure you get infinite water for this, so... You know, just Mario Sunshine. Just because. Oh, uh, uh, Mayro, Mayro. Just gotta clean, gotta clean the mud. And there's spots still around. And then that was the last one. Okay. All right. And you know what? You know what that means? It means I gotta do this. First try. Thank the good Lord. Travel in the temple. Okay, guys, we're gonna travel in the temple. Conveniently, right here. More Zelda music. What's funny is that the guy who made this hack actually made an entire hack where he just he just turned Mario 64 into the entirety of Ocarina of Time. Oh, you thought you were getting Lost World vibes before. Seems today that all you see No
Yeah. Okay, now now we're I think over there the snake's coming up to join us. Either way. What's up, brave adventurer? I have something interesting for you. When I first got up here, I heard a voice that said, Step on my head and I shall give you the star, but please don't pound on me. That hurts. I think the snake was communicating with me. But I'm much too I'm too much of a scaredy cat to try it for myself. Yeah, I've never seen anybody do like such wacky things with this game as that guy. Oh, okay, step on head. Take me to the golden land. I can make the camera do this. A lot of waiting in that star, but that's okay. If only I had the uh, flood here, then I could get this one up. Yeah, a part of the problem is that it's kind of hard to adjust the camera to where you got a good angle on where you want Mario to be. Star Road actually had a, a camera hack where it operated more like a modern camera, and you could just move it. Like, it was built on the assumption that you were going to be playing it with, like, an Xbox 360 controller. But this one was, too, so that's a little weird. Because there were a lot of things where you kind of had to use the L button. You know, I can't really blame them, because, you know, Mario 64, there's not a lot of buttons free. But the L button on the Nintendo 64 controller, not super easy to access. Puzzle panel. Oh, I hated this mission. I'm not gonna lie to you. So, first thing we wanna do, we wanna go up here, get stuck on the blocks. And then we wanna grab Flood again. And then we want to go into the giant snake head. Oh, I forgot. In an earlier version, you used to use Flood with the L button, but he changed it to the A button, I think. So I'm not used to that. Come on, let me up. Let me up. Okay. No. Oh, <laughs> I thought you had to press it. And oh. But no, holding it down also works. Okay, now then. This is gonna be most of the stream, probably, if I remember correctly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk to me. Hey, you, be careful around here. My friends over there weren't, and now they're trapped inside the cage. I believe I can free them if I solve this puzzle, but it's really hard. Right now, I'm waiting for one of the other scientists. He thinks that the solution to the puzzle is engraved into that snake statue outside. He must be deciphering the ancient glyphs on it right now. No, actually, the uh, the answer to the puzzle is right there. Okay, so... Oh boy, yep. It's all coming back to me. It's all coming back. Oh, uh, come on, we're so close. Yeah. 
just need to toggle. Oh lord. Yeah, I, I this is pretty much the worst mission in the game. <laughs> Pretty much, pretty much. Oh, okay. In fact, I think when I initially played this game, I just saved this one for later. And I might do that again. All things considered. Because this mission sucks! This is like, this is like final egg on crack, basically. Okay, that's good. That's good right there. Now we just need like, eh. eh no, no, actually we want this on. And then we want this, but then, but then we got this odd boy right here. I'm not good with video game puzzle. I'll make that known right out, right off the, the gate. Okay, so we want the whole bottom layer except for the third one to be off. Eh, eh. Just, just hit, just hit blocks randomly. That's my, that's my strategy for this. <laughs> I hate it so bad. Kaze, if at any point you ever watch this, just do me a solid. Remove this entire star. Like, just... <laughs> like, I would rather try to, like, clip through the gate. <laughs> Yeah, the, the flood kind of renders that hard to do. Hard to do a backwards long jump with flood. Not that I even think it would really work here. Come on, let's let's just try it. Let's let's try clip through the clip through. It seems like you could get something to work here. Very clippable. Yeah, problem is flood kind of cancels your backwards long jump state. I feel like you could maybe make this work. Yeah, like there's there's a there's potential here. I mean, it says a lot that I would rather try to glitch through the door than do the actual puzzle. If I could just like... Is there any button I can press to like cease to have blood? Doesn't look like it. Come on, Mario. All you gotta do is clip just a little bit. <laughs> okay, I'll try to do the puzzle for a little while. Okay, so... Okay, no, 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 no. No, no, no. So we want, we want that one turned on, but not the one below it. And not that one either.
Hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Good. Good video game puzzle. <laughs> I'm really feeling it! Sorry. Hang on, I could probably stand to, like, have my, uh, soundboard up. <laughs> yeah, you didn't think that would come back, did you? You thought the soundboard was dead. It wasn't dead, it was only sleeping. Yeah, this is legitimately my least favorite star in the game, probably. Just because, like, 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 even, even discounting, like, even, even counting the stars that make you do, like, insane platforming challenges. Like, even, even with those taken into, a, into account. Even with those taken into account, this is the worst. This is the biggest argument against me doing a 100% run. It's just this star. It's like, eh. 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 And then E. 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 Let's, let's do another star in this level instead. We'll come back to this one later. But the problem is we don't get a hint. Let's do let's do the red coin star. You know, we can get we can get two that way. Get two entire star. I don't know. I just I don't want to subject you guys to that right now. <laughs> I just don't I don't want to do it <laughs> I don't want to subject me to that right now come on lad give me the bite that's your lot in life alright so there's a way to get on top of this oh you know Having the flood, even even if I'm not gonna do that mission, having the flood would probably be a good idea. For a variety of reasons. I mean, let's just be real here. Having a hover ability is useful. Also, my microphone is still going into the red entirely too much. And I think I just might be trying to make these streams way too loud. Like, I could probably stand for them to be just on average quieter. That would probably solve a lot of problems. I don't know. We'll worry about that later, though. Because it's not, like, super obnoxious, I don't think. It's just kind of a thing. Just kind of a thing. Okay, now. Even still. 
I'm still not entirely sure how to do like okay. Eh, eh, no, no. Eh, eh, eh. Okay, there you go. And there's like a one up up here, I think. Yes. Yeah, it's just like some mild clipping. Like I've heard worse. I just, you know, I just don't like it. I'm I'm very much a perfectionist. And you know, knowing that there's a big old flaw I could be fixing drives me insane. You know how it is. Yeah, because we can get the we can get the 100 coins too, so that's a useful thing. Uh, but I should have probably sp spawned in the balls so I could get the coins from them. I think there's two. Oh, there's a whole bunch of red coins over here. Yeah, like there's three on this structure alone. All right. Come on. Yeah, balls of steel. I uh, might be cutting it a little close, I don't know. Mm, let's see. There's another piranha plant over here. And that'll give me a few. Give me, I think, exactly four. Oh, yeah, I want to get these. I want to get these. Spraying the dirt didn't give me any coins, I don't think. Let me, let me find out. No, no, no coins for cleaning. Unpaid cleaning job. I mean, there's some in the snake zone, I think. Was there, was there, were there coins in the crate? Yes, there were. Okay, there's some in Snake Town, West Virginia. Okay, so I need about three more. Are there any, like, actually in here? Doesn't look like it. Solved the puzzle by sheer fluke. Nope, no, no fluke solve. Just, just run across, run, run. Just do this. Eventually, you will happen upon the right combination. That's how probability works. That's how mafia works. Actually, I could probably get a better setup just by doing that, probably. Than me try actually trying to figure out the puzzle. I'm sorry, I know I'm not giving the puzzle a fair shake, but I also just do not want to. Alright, so we need three coins. Where can we get three coins? Are there any in the tent? Okay, so if, if I go into the temple... Can I leave it? I hope I didn't despawn the red coin star, though. I mean, not that it's hard to get the red coins back. A 100 coin challenge is more of a challenge.
Okay, now does that stay spawned? Yes, it does. Very good. Very good. All right, so we just got two left, and one of them is the aforementioned, you, you know. All right, we'll give it one more try. I feel like one of them is on the pillar next to the snake head, like at the top there. Let me, let me see. Oh yeah, I had a feeling that it would keep track of like, you know, my coins. I just wasn't sure if the star itself would despawn. Nope. 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 Come on, Mayro. Come on. I gotta remember it's not the L button. Okay, is that... Oh. Luckily, I did not take fall damage. Probably not. This is probably not. Oh. Oh, hey, there's a one up there. You know, I should probably grind these one ups when I ha while I have the opportunity. But yeah, this is a good one up grinding spot. Okay, no, that's just coins that I really could have used earlier. I wonder if blood negates fall damage entirely. Just gonna, like I said, just gonna round up these one-ups while I got them. I'm gonna backwards long jump up these stairs and to the snake. In fact, you know, that, that pro I joke, but that maybe could work if I was skilled enough, which you know I am not. I could just use the crate, honestly. All right, we're gonna give it, we're gonna give it the honest go. Like, I'll give it, I'll give it its fair shake. But first, we are just going to... No, let's see. Let's, let's really think about this. Eh? Like, that does pretty much exactly what I want it to. Like, this... It's the problem is this one right here. This is the outlier. So, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. I got, I got an idea. I might have... Actually, I might have screwed it up. Yeah, I screwed up the... No, wait, 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 wait. We got this. We got a condition here. So if I step on this, it'll turn that one on. It'll, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's try doing this. Oh, no, no. Put it back. Okay, that right there. And... Doop, there we go. Best star in the entire game. Wow, thanks for opening this cage. You truly are a mastermind. Thank you, game, for stroking my ego. Here we go. <laughs> Camera flies out of bounds. Alright. Now let me get this one up again. 
like I said, we're gonna need- and they do save in this game, I believe. Unfortunately, that quality also works against me, which means that I, if I am lower than five lives, I still don't get my lives back when I quit. Calm the ancient attacker. So yeah, you can do it. You gotta be better than I am, but... We should have never started this. We should have left it the first signal, and now we're getting punished. I'm sorry that you d are getting dragged into this. I apologize. Oh, he coming. Here he comes. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Let me back, let me back. Okay, I can't climb up because the snake is in the way. Haha! <laughs> you thought you had me. Better get that one up while I can. Well, I mean, the, the snake is made out of stone and the sand bird is made out of sand. I don't think it's really a fair fight. Oh, the, the one-up's not here. Dang it. Okay. Yeah, come over this way, snake bird. Is that it? I thought I'd have to take out all of it. Oh well. Here we go. Oh well. And now we can go to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. But we're not gonna do that yet. Yep, yep, dog, oh, nerd, nerd. Nerd. Come on, come on. No! This is not the easiest one up in the world to get, I will admit that. I've already admitted that. But yeah, we're going to level three next. Not, not space, which is level four, I think. Go on a boat! Labor in the lighthouse. So after that kind of ominous level, we get this, you know, this nice little level. Boats and sunshine. Sunset beach. With a nice little tune. Isn't this a relaxing place? I hope you enjoy your stay as much as I do. Miles, you're not allowed to say that. Hmm. It might be. But here it's used to inflate a balloon. 
Anyway, let's go to the lighthouse. Well, first, let's get these coins. I would like to get 50 coins, because then I could get a 1-up. So let me do that real quick. Oh, I somehow misread Langton's comment as being from you. But you know what? You're not allowed to say it either. Chats. Chat is a place. Just, you know, let me, let me be. You know, Q Song of Storms. A lot of Ocarina of Time in this. Mario Climbed. Okay. Here we go. Let me let me waste your time again. Then waste too much time. What if I land up here? Oh, Mario just teleports down below. Explore the shell. Okay. Gotta go into the shell, I guess. First, gotta find the shell. Ooh. Oh, there it is. Yeah, one day I'll, I'll stream Sunshine, don't you worry about that. Oh, and neat little detail, that the game has a separate air meter now. No, it leads into Banjo-Kazooie. And that is, I think that is literally a Pokemon. But I mean, gotta get a 3D model of a crab somewhere. Just a little doot. A little doot of music. And yeah, I know there's there's light coming out of like the bird bath over there. But we're not doing that yet. <laughs> this is gonna get really annoying, isn't it? It probably already has. But it's, it'll be worth it. Because this, this game does get legit pretty hard later. Move to the mountaintop. No, Mario, don't slide down the sand. Look, I don't care if it's at an incline. Sand is not usually this slippery. And now we get the second original power-up. The Fire Flower. I can press L to make fire happen. But I think that if I touch the water, that I lose it. 
so probably gonna need to use a boat. I mean, let you know, we could probably confirm or deconfirm that theory, uh, but we won't. E Blow that up. Now you can climb this. Can destroy the spinies with it, so that's good. Here we go. Oh, didn't go get the one up. That's okay. Coral reefs, red coins. Yeah, this is pretty much straight up a Mario Sunshine mission. Anyway, this will probably be the time when we get 100 coin star. So let's just do that. Have enjoyment. When I was little, I thought that the fish in Mario Sunshine would eat you, but no, they just kind of drag you to the bottom. Considerably, considerably less terrifying. At least in the context of video game. In real life, if a fish dragged me to the bottom, I'd, I'd probably still be pretty terrified. That being said, I'd still prefer it over being eaten, so... I don't know, maybe my, maybe my statement still stands. Now, I know you can defeat these crabs, but I forget how you do it. Is it like punch them from the back? Come here, come here, Lakitu. Lak, Lakitu. Oh. Great. That was a death worthy of the history books. Just slide into a spiny. Try that. Let's try that again. This time with feeling. <laughs> but do not feel the spinies. That would be a good idea. Also, I recognize this building as being from Banjo-Tooie. But I mean, that's alright, you know. Can't make all the assets yourself when you're working on a budget of literally nothing. Goombas have a really weird death sound in Mario 64 when you think about it. Okay, come in, come in. Okay, there we go. Now that's the kind of thing we wanted to happen in the first place. Now, now, how does one combat crab? Not by doing that, that's for sure. Or that, or the. Jesus, what kind of damage does that thing do? Yeah. 
Okay, more feeling than last time. I swear, though, there's a way to... to combat those guys. Okay, no, I thought that trick would work. Didn't. Didn't work. Alright, for real. For real. And not for fake. need every coin that we can possibly obtain. Do you matter for sure? I love how you can see the lack of two off in the corner. <laughs> and then, until it spawns in. Like, it's visible, but it still hasn't begun activity mode. Okay. So is there an eatable fish in here? An eat a eat fine fish? I mean, this is Mario 64, so... There's a fish, I don't think it's an eat a, eat -a fine one. Yeah, it's too small to be a eat an eat fish, it's just a regular fish. It might be a poke Mario in the butt and hurt him fish, but I don't think it's an eat eat a eat a fiable fish. Yeah, I mean, where's all the seafood on Isle Delfino? All I ever see in that game is fruit. Okay, last coin. Gotta find it. Gotta find it, but Mario cannot hold his breath for very long in this game. So it is considerably trickier than it would be otherwise. Maybe it's down here. No, I think I already went here. I mean, it doesn't hurt to check, but... Come on. Where is it? Here, boy. There it is. Okay, but we're not going to get that yet. Okay, that was some good skipping. Let me go up on the shore. Ship. Shipwrecked. So if I burn these guys with a fire flower, do they give me coins? Adjust horizon. Yeah, Mario gets stuck in the geometry. Oh, there's a coin over there. I mean, I know where a few more are. Yeah. I just don't want to have to break out the fire flower and go over there for for one coin if I can help it So let's let's see. Oh no wait, no wait. There's some in the lighthouse. All right. <laughs> okay, bye Mario.
Okay, now where's that coral reef again? There it is. Hurt. No wait, we got a new area. Oh, and there's the mini game house. How about this? We'll check out the mini game house once we uh, get done with this level. Yahoo! Now, if only I could find my other self. Oh, somebody pulled the plug. The water, it's gone. Someone must have removed the drain stopper. I was joking! Everything is ruined if you can't find it and put it back in. Mario, stop, stop being unable to walk on sand. Look, look at this. Mario, come on. My dude. My bro. Okay, well, there, there's the stopper. Where am I putting it? Okay. Don't push through crab. Oh, uh, I think I think I see. No, that's just a crab shadow. Okay, just gotta figure out where it goes. Get some coin. It's gotta be on the dry part, because Mario can't push stuff underwater. Follow the cra- oh, there it is, there it is. I think. Yeah, that's it. Okay, now just one left. Blimp and lighthouse. And I know exactly what I must do. We must guide it. That's a very Toy Story 2 star. And I can't believe I've streamed that game already. It oh. oh. Okay. Her her Here we go. Okay. And now as promised, let's check out the mini game house. As soon as I get uh, this one up again, which will take three hours exactly. <laughs> I almost don't want it. like this is a very safe one up to get, but it's obnoxious. Okay, so let's check out 
Yeah, Donkey Kong 64. It's got like a cell shaded outline, which is kind of astounding. Favorite color. Oh, okay, so you got you got some details here. Stars 22, coin score total, game overs, one ups, calculated score, press L for coin details. Yep, there you go. Favorite color. Oh, what? They don't have red in here? Of all things? The color, now I'll go with blue, I guess. Welcome to the Toad House. Over here, you can play mini games and check your stats. If you want to play mini games, go into the next room and step on a switch. My coworker will be happy to explain any game to you. Just talk to him. And I think uh, you can unlock a sound test here. So yeah, you got some mini games. In Whack-A-Mole, you try to jump on as many moles as possible. Try to get multiple bounces for fast clears. All right, let's play it. I might not get the stars with these yet, but... Yes, it is. Er It all depends on how tricky getting the stars ends up being. Otherwise, I may save it for later. I will do it, though. But yeah, this is a very all-out sort of ROM hack. I will give Kaze that. He, he really put the extra elbow grease in this, mini games and everything. Oh. Well, okay, I got the... I got the star. Here we go. Okay, now... In Hexagon Heat. Yeah, you know, it's the Mario Party main game. Oh, and they even say right there, hey, it's from Mario Party. Yeah, Hexagon Heat is a personal favorite of mine, pers personally, personally. Okay, so I think I have to get up to 20 to get the star. Okay, blue again. Oh, light blue, cyan, what have you. Okay, dark blue again. Dark blue again. There's a bit of a bias here. A bit of a blue bias. White. But if you live, you get coins. Doesn't give you a lot of time to react, though. Yeah, butt clinch noises are about all I can muster right now. Well... <laughs> Alright. And that's the minigame house.
Now let's all let's do this. Let's let's check this out. There he goes. It's a Mario Galaxy. Okay, that's not a platform. Mamma mia. Did I lo I think I lost a life from that, so I better collect this one. <laughs> I'll be honest, there are some parts of this game that, you know, there are flaws, but some of the flaws really can't be helped just by virtue of it being a hack of Mario 64. Like, yeah, the collision detection's gonna suck every now and then, but that's just kind of how Mario 64 is. They hide it very well in the game proper, but in ROM hacks it sometimes falls apart. Okay, let's go this way. Wait, 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 what's the, what's the button? <laughs> I pressed L, I thought that was it. Did he change it to something else? Mamma mia. I should probably try and figure that out before I make a giant jump to my death. That would probably be wise. And see, this, this is the sort of thing we're gonna need these lives for later. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh no! A oh, few. <laughs> I thought. I thought for a moment I was in homosexual infant prison. Okay. Let's... Okay, so you just press A again now. Mm, pardon me. So yeah, apparently... Kaze must have heard the criticisms to, uh... The criticisms about the button layout. Okay, is there something good in here? You have more cloud. Hey you! Get off of my cloud! I'm not entirely sure where I'm heading here. There's like a castle off in the distance, but I don't think I'm expected to go to it. Oh, okay, so I can... I can stack them. So let's just try going up for now. Oh, no, dang it. <laughs> Alright. Understandable, have a nice day. So I forget, I think I tried, but you can't get but two, right? Yeah, you can only get two. Three is just plain and simple out of the question. Ooh, yeah, we're getting some of them... some of them jumps. Oh, oh, I don't like that guy. I don't like that guy. <laughs> okay, I've made it up here. Now what? I guess this way. No, no. I'm going back. I ain't dealing with that. No, please long jump and not uh, ground pound. Thank you. Oh. Um. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> yeah, this 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 one kind of hurts my soul a little bit. Okay. Can I take? Okay, I don't want this guy to kill me. Okay, I think he only blows in one direction. 
Okay, there's a cloud right there. I don't feel like I'm gonna be able to get to that. I'm gonna go back down. And get... I'm gonna try to get over with one cloud. Okay, so yes, that, that works. Huh. Huh. Yep, there you go. Okay. Done and done. Now to go to space, I think. There, There's another level in here somewhere, I think. Yeah, it's like in here. I don't know if I've unlocked it. Oh, yeah, I have. Oh, no, wait, this is level four. Cracking cave. So, space must be level five. Okay, so this is where my memory of the mission starts getting a little hazier. hazier. That's a nice crystal. Crystal effect. Just kind of got to explore around, rediscover what it means to be alive. Oh, and there's a new... There's a new power-up in this level, too. Do you have any business around here? We mermaids do not like being talked to by random strangers. Don't stare at me, you pervert. Alright, well... Apparently these mermaids are a real sociable bunch. Look, lady. My name's Mario, and I'm trying to, you know, save the world from an apocalypse. Trying to make it to where we don't die. Yeah, pretty much Zora's domain. I don't think this is where the star is. I'll admit, my memories of this level are a bit hazier than the other ones. Let's, let's go, let's go back. To get the red coin mission. You know, that one's nice and simple. Okay, I think we want to go... I think we want to go like this way, or this way. There's a lot of ways we could go. Spider web. Oh, there, there they are. There's the scuttlebug. I think. Are those things still scuttlebugs? Are they like those water things? Got like silver stars from 64 DS in here. I mean, I could get those. Maybe the best way to figure out what the star is is to narrow down what it isn't. That's the scientific method. Getting some coins just for extra life. Uh, uh, Mario, come on. Oh, what? Oh, I got two new Twitch followers. Thank you, fellas. Thank you for the follow. They didn't <laughs> they didn't show up in the chat at any point, but I appreciate it regardless. Okay, and there's another one over there. Come on, let's get it. Let's get it. And there you go. That's one star from this level down.
Which wasn't the one I was actually meant to get. Okay, the cracking kick. Oh, wait, wait. The preview, that's it. Okay, so I want to go down that one way that I almost went and then got distracted and went another way. No, no, see, like, the opposite of this way. Yeah, I want to go this way, I think. Maybe, probably, I actually have no idea. Boulder? <laughs> Poor Mario. Is this what we mean by the cracking cave? Boulder? Yes, yes, more followers on the Twitch. Soon, Steamp, Steampy. Soon I will be all powerful. Oh, hi, Hazy Maze Cave. No, I can get up there. There's, there's an easier way to get up there, almost certainly. But I don't want to take it, because I'm an American. And the meaning of America is to try to do things the hard way and then give up. Like I did just now. And then end up doing it the hard way anyway. And then slide down a cliff. All of that is what our forefathers founded America on the basis of. I could probably do a triple jump. Her yeah, like that. Okay, that's the star I was meant to get. So I think this course is just open the entire time. Which is weird. Underwater race. Now there's something I'm gonna wanna find. Like, I know what this mission is, but there's something I'm gonna wanna find before I do it. And it's one of the new power-ups in this game. I'm going to want that, I think. Can you fall through this? I, I kind of don't want to find out. I might end up inadvertently finding out. Okay, so it, it's not over here. I could probably just get the red coin star and be done with it. I don't know. Then again, I also want to get the 100 coin star. I feel like it was in a cave of some kind. Well, I mean, the whole level's in a cave, no duh, Sherlock. But, uh... I mean, a cave within this cave. Alright. It's like it's around here somewhere, I think. M maybe it's over here. No, okay, this leads to, uh, it's not in Mermaid Town. It might be this one. Yes, they, I think this is it right here. Frog Mario. And his power is he swim real good. will make this mission entirely easier. And by that, I mean it's still going to be a pain in the butt. Be ready for it. Aren't these just like an edited woman from Zelda? I'm 90% sure that's like an edited Zelda NPC. Uh, please. No. 
I think it's with her that you gotta initiate this. Hey loser, do you think a mere human could stand a chance in a race against a mermaid? If so, prove it. And I forget where exactly you want to go to do the race. I think it's this way. Yeah, it's this way. Which way? Which way? I can't see. Can't see. Crap. Can't see. Yeah, this was the problem I had with this mission before. Oh, right. You got to go through the rings. I've already failed. Okay, so once you go in here, you're pretty much trapped forever. <laughs> but it's alright, I botched that mission anyway. So let's do this one. Like a freaking Zelda dungeon. Yeah, I think I think that he might have actually gotten rid of fall damage. Yeah, there's a lot of Zelda in this game. I wonder if... I wonder if Kaze, by any chance, likes Ocarina of Time. It's entirely possible. Now, I, I completely forgot... Well, there's a one-up in here. Okay, there's a passage here that goes up here. I'm not even really sure where the star is. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I know what you do. I know what you do. You gotta push. You gotta give it the old push. Yeah, I'm thinking Kaze likes Z The Legend of Zelda. Just a hunch. Now go into pipe. Okay, got key. This color palette really reminds me a lot of like early DOS games. You know how they had that one color palette? I forget what what it was and why. Okay, push button. What do? Okay, it it creates a bridge to creates a bridge. So I can press another button. Now what does that do? Oh hey, uh, magical mystery mystery. Oh, and there's a bridge over here. star oh oh good leg cramp ow ow oh I'm dying I am dying in real life okay now now let's try that again the the actual mission that I came here to do, not the not the one I ended up doing. <laughs> yes, Miles, Mario 64 has bump mapping. Can't you tell just by looking at Oh god, my leg. Arr. <laughs> ow, oh god, the other one. Ow, ow, ow. Uh, 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 oh, uh, uh. oh, ah, ah, Ooh. Uh, 
I just gotta work through it. <laughs> but hey, I'm mixing it up. The problem with my leg is entirely different this time. Okay, now I gotta keep... Like, what the heck? What is this camera? <laughs> Game! Game! Okay, once I get in here, I stand a slight chance. No, oh, oh, the ring didn't count. The ring did not count. <laughs> and since I didn't beat her, then I did not beat her. Oh yeah, and the frog suit also lets Mario be air the ancient and powerful dad stone well I guess let's try another mission then I, d I don't know if you can reset it maybe if you leave and come back mermaid statue mermaid statue that Mario must walk all over to achieve the coin belt she's wearing. It's like that episode of Simpsons where Homer grabs the candy off of the babysitter's butt, except with coins. My life-size Krabby Patty replicas of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Don't worry, it's just a statue of a mermaid. Totally different. Now keep in mind that the mermaid called Mario a pervert before he felt up the statue. Man, Mario 64 camera is just the wackiest thing, is it not? He had to do it, Miles, for money. Now first, I'm gonna see, can you, can you respawn the mermaid, or if you fail, do you just have to exit the level? Camera, what in the name of God are you on about? No, okay, mermaid, mermaid is done. Once you fail, you fail. So I'll just do the red coin mission and the 100 coin mission instead. Uh, there's one in here that I somehow did not notice before. At least I don't think I noticed. Yeah, there's a power up in this game where Mario wears, like, a white polo shirt and, like, denim khakis. And he just... Pr you press the L button and he just does that pose. It has no... it has no gameplay benefit. He just does the pose. You know, honestly, given... given Kaze's back catalog, I would honestly not be surprised if he made a hack where that was the main difference. It's just, it's just Mario's idle animation is putting his hands together. 
and, and just doing that pose. Okay, so no, no, you can't fall through that. As far as I can tell. Oh, no, wait, there's a coin embedded in the wall in a goofy fashion. Still collectible, though. Okay, we could get that, but we don't want to get that yet. We want to get the 100 coin star. The star of the rich people. And we can do that pretty easily using these guys. I mean, I probably had an X64 coin count at one point. Hello, Hypernova. And yeah, there we go. And collecting that makes me lose my frog suit. What a rip. <laughs> Mario 64's freaking camera. Like, even, even when it's been improved, it's still not that good. Mario was green because he had the frog suit. I feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh Lord. Nope, wrong, wrong cave. I wonder how many pieces of weird geometry you could backwards long jump off of. <laughs> yeah, that, that always struck me as kind of funny too. But you know, angst, what angst? There's no angst. Okay, now see, I'm not gonna say that I've lost already, but I've probably lost already. You gotta be kinda on the money with your positioning here. But you also gotta be quick. Can't afford to take it slow. Can't afford to rock out the show. No, no, no! Okay, luckily exiting the level costs no lives. Solve my maze, Superman. Lex wins. Just so you all know, I do own that game. I could stream it at any point, and there's nothing you could do to stop me. Have you thought about that? Have you considered that? What you're doing here, you're enabling me. Before, I would only subject myself to this, but now, now you guys are watching. Hence, form is, uh, 
the second form of the final boss of Super Ancient Keys. You know, a lesser man would consider save stating here. Uh, I think it's just Jabo's 3D. And I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna say, like, yo, my dog used Glide N64 and I, I can't right now. Because my graphics card's drivers make me want to die. Yeah, it's one of those issues where I don't think I'm going to be able to use it until I get a new computer. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the problem is, there is a way I could get Glide N64 to work, but it would disable sleep mode on my computer. Because once... If I update the drivers, and I tried to come out of sleep mode, my display never turns back on. Which sucks the big one. Camera. Save the mermaids. Why, what have the mermaids ever done for me? Yeah, I mean, the solution's obviously to just like leave the computer open the entire time. My lord, what, what, what are you? Okay, I don't think I have any method with which to do damage to you. So... So just clip into the wall. <laughs> All right. If you say so. <laughs> Alright, what do you gotta say? Do you have any tips? Mario, we really need your help. The sea monster we had caged in here somehow escaped. Oh, lure him... Lure him into the cage. Is this the cage? I think this is the cage. This way, boy. Oh. This way. Come in here. I'm running out of air. I ain't got all day. Oh, no, wait. That wasn't the cage. That was not the cage at all. But now he's dead. <laughs> More Zelda music. This is the cage. Mission Compris. Whoop. Whoop. Thanks for helping me. I don't know how I could thank you. Weren't you searching for power stars? It's not much compared to what you did for us, but maybe it helps repaying just a bit of our moral debt to you. Yeah, the biggest challenge of that mission is figuring out where the cage is. Okay, and I'll probably do maybe one more level. Because I feel like a bunch of people have showed up, and I don't want to just end it right as they get here. So let's go into space. Get into the base. Ooh, pardon. Ah. 
huh. This level sure seems a little familiar. <laughs> Media her. Yes, yeah, your main man Knuckles. I, I mean Mario. And we and we at. Oh, it's a conveyor thing. And we at abandoned outpost. You ready? Here we are, abandoned outpost. We looking for the stars, getting the most. We looking all around. Stars everywhere to be found. Eggman space. I mean Bowser space. Cause Eggman ain't in this game that we know of. But Zelda is, uh. I don't remember how to do the mission, uh. <laughs> but yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of references in this game. <laughs> that reminds me, I gotta get back to streaming Sonic Adventure, the bonus content. Got, you know, an HDMI adapter for the Dreamcast. Everything is it's nice. It's real nice. So, so Sonic Adventure's like post-game content is gonna look a lot better than my normal playthrough of the game. Oh, and there's the like Octo Goombas from uh from Galaxy, and they're even more annoying here than they were there. Yeah, I got some got some custom enemies in this game. Ter terminate her too. Whoop whoop. Oh, was that a meteor? Okay, there's a switch. Okay, I hit the switch and get attacked by a meteor for my trouble. So, this is like the red area, so I think the red door would open, maybe? Nah, like... They don't tell you this, because I didn't talk to the Lakitu, but... Lack of two quit in this game. He he's he's out of business. So maybe this is what happens when you fire Lack of two. Okay, that's just a star on its own. You've got a secret bonus point. I'm sorry, I was just talking about Hetty and I wanted to play that. Okay, so you got- Alright, so you have to go into the blue silos. Which I think these are them right here. I am very observant. I probably will stream Dynamite Hetty before too long. That and maybe Kit Chameleon. Cause you know, I got those that Genesis SCART cable. Uh, I got that now. All right, so this is the blue, so the blue door should open. Yeah, I don't think there's I don't think there's fall damage in this, which is very nice of him. I didn't remember that. Oh no, that's the red one. I want the blue one. Yeah, there's a few things. There's a few, like, stream ideas I've been sitting on them 
sitting on with. Like, Miles and I still have to do that multiplayer Sonic thing we've been talking about. But I'm just... That's just more work, and I'm lazy. I'm sure you understand. And also, something about me needing to, uh... You know, build up my own commentary skills. Okay, Mario, just don't grab the ledge. Fine, Mario, we'll play things your way. I don't think that's how that works. Either of you. The platform cluster. Oh, you don't get a preview for this one, do you? So you just have to sit there and imagine just what on earth the platform cluster is. Because the game's certainly not going to tell you. And there's... I have no idea if, like, the conveyor belt effect is intentional, but it's nice. I keep hearing that sound, and I keep thinking that, yeah, Mario can walk up this just fine, but sand? No way. No way. Don't be ridiculous. Go, go, get your boom. Go, go, get your boom. Go, get your boom. Go, get your boom. <laughs> it's probably a good thing that there's so much, like, Sonic Adventure 1, uh, Sonic Adventure 1, like, back catalog extra content. Because, uh, I still haven't managed to get my hands on Sonic Adventure 2 for Dreamcast yet. I mean, granted, there's nothing explicitly saying that I have to do it, like, right away. But... So is this yellow? So the yellow door, maybe? What are you? What's the deal? What is the deal with you? All right, whatever that interaction was. Oh, so there's a fire flower in this level. That's good. Yeah, this game has a lot of new power-ups. Some of them a little underutilized, but still cool. Like... I could be wrong, but I feel like the frog suit only shows up in that level I just beat, and never again for the entire rest of the game. I could be wrong about that, though. Oh, we haven't seen you yet. You know what I'm surprised nobody's made? I'm so like, a hack that turns Mario into Knuckles and turns it into, like, the emerald hunting stages from Adventure 2. Like, just make it to where the stars, uh, the stars don't take you out of the level. And the hardest part, I think, would be to program the radar. I mean, if Kaze did it, he's already done, he's already put Knuckles in, uh, Net 64, I think it was called. I want it. Yahoo! 
Alright, let's go up and look for the platform cluster. Though at this point, it might be just more worth it to, uh... Might just be more worth it to get the red coin star. I mean, I'll be honest, I don't mind the him the Himerald... The Himerald hunting stages. Like, even when they did gimp the radar, I didn't find them too offensive. Granted, would I rather be playing Sonic and Shadows levels? Yes. But, you know, I feel like my least favorite in Adventure 2 was actually Eggman and Tails stages. They're just not as fun as Gamma, in my opinion. Oh yeah, there's a star that you gotta shoot to and it's kind of a pain in the butt. Oh yeah, and that thing, that space thing, whatever that- I think this is the platform cluster that was mentioned. But yeah, like I said, I'm gonna... Yeah, no fall damage. That I- if- if nothing confirms it, that- that does. But yeah, I'm gonna- I'm gonna go for the red coins. Lost my fire flower, but that's okay. Give up the emeralds or die. I don't love you. Robe it. Robe it. Oh, you gotta love that. The the shooting star. I'm not gonna get that yet, but Gotta love that pun. Burp. And yes, you actually do have to collect that star. I'll give him one thing, this hack is creative. It's got some ideas. You pose a valid point, but that's statistically unlikely. Oh, and then this fella... ...is guarding the, uh... Okay, we can at least get the 100 coin star, at least. Now I just gotta find the rest of the red ones. Yeah, Mario, wall jump up off the stairs. Get caught on the, the corner there. I might have to diversify my searching a bit. Oh, no wait, there's one. Surprisingly, surprisingly generous draw distance. I have the hiccups and I blame you, as you should. Did Mario just... Yep, you can make him throw a fireball backwards. As he should. As God intended. Well, let's check, let's check out over here. Maybe there's a, a red coin at the top of this, I already forgot. I actually have no idea. 
Oh, we can get some more regular koi. We can use this as a vantage point, maybe. Oh, nope, don't. Don't do that. Nope, no coin up here. Gotta find the coin. Oh, there's a coin. There we go. The song sounds pretty good with Mario 64 instruments, in my humble opinion. Here we go. Not that anybody asked for it. Okay, so I don't know if I gotta reopen the door or what, but just in case I'll go up here or try and fail to go up here. Mario, please. Oh, uh, pasta pesto. An aquatic herd. No! Yeah, the reason the rocket sounds like a machine gun is because Kaze just used uh, the explosion sound effect. <laughs> Gotta make do with what you got. I don't- I haven't heard of anybody adding new sound effects on Moss to, uh, Mario 64. Maybe a couple of them, but not, like, a whole ton of them. Okay, so now we know where the platform cluster is. Probably. Is it the red door? No. Oh, you know what? We could probably get the... Nah, you know what? We'll do, we'll do the cluster. We'll get to the shooting star when we get there. Then again, in, in Releasio, they, uh... It was more like replacing Mario's voice, so I, I don't know. I'm talking entirely out of my butt. So don't, don't take my word for it. Take someone else's word for it, because my word is worth literally nothing. <laughs> this isn't the one I went up before. Yeah, we want to go over there. Hold on just a moment.
All right, I'm back. I had I had to take that. Oh, I didn't mean to go in the cannon. Whatever, we'll make this work. Oh, there's a star up there. Cinematic camera angles. <laughs> Very uncinematic camera angles. I like how that didn't even damage me. It just it just hit me. Now where's the where's the cluster? It's all the way over there. What the heck? Oh no, it's the spiral staircase that I want to go to. That's it. Yeah, there we go. Now let's cl let's cluster. Cluster's revenge. Like a pro Thinking emoji. Try that again. The technology isn't completely there yet. Now let's try that once more. You know the drill with feeling. Oh. That could have been bad. Luckily, I am the master. Shoot into the space. Okay, so yeah, the great... Okay, now I need to do a test before I do anything else. Do I actually need to hit the switch here every time? Or can I just, uh... Can I just do this? Okay, no, the door, the door opens without you needing to... So what's the switch do? I mean, it plays Mario Odyssey. But beyond that... Artsy Proud Snood Future Man. I am going to make a game or song with that title. And there's nothing you fools can do to stop me. Where's where's the cannon? Oh, there it is. It's on this one. All right. Now I have n no real frame of reference for where I want to shoot with this, so I'll shoot just just a hair above the star. Is this the part where I get flashbacks to Mario's holiday?
Let's do it right above the meteor. Okay, it needs to be needs to be higher than that. Luckily, luckily he put that net there so that we don't fall all the way to the start of the level. Okay, so it's got to be higher than the meteor. Got it, got it. Oh, there's a... Hang on. Oh. I want that one up. For reasons I have established. I wonder if you could just wall jump up there. Nah, the too far apart. Okay, I don't want it that bad. I still want it kind of bad, but not not that bad. I lied. Don't. <laughs> My hubris knows no bounds. Okay, just a little bit of a frame drop there. All right, all right. Higher than the meteor. So like, let's try right about here. Er, er, oh. oh, just shy. Just shy. I love the pop in on those, those platforms over there. I mean, granted, I get it. Okay, let's shoot directly... Like, right on here. Here. Oh, no, just shy, just shy. Even, even just shyer than before. Do it like right here. Eh. Eh. No, nope, no, that's now that's too high. But you can use that meteor as a good aiming thing. So you remember that thing I said about the hubris? one was it? I think it was Mario. Mario. It's just this and Alright, but this is this is the one. I'm calling it. This is the one where we get it. Yes! Here we go! And now one last star to get in this level. And we know which one that one is. Keep it pointed up at the sky, probably. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it breaks. I don't know if it spawns in this same spot again.
Oh, yep, it do. But you gotta catch it. Oh, but the trajectory is different. Oh, there you go. Here we go. Anyway, I realize it's a bit of an anti-climax, but I'm, I'm going to end it there. So, hope you guys had fun. I'll see you around. Hopefully, hopefully I won't keep you waiting as long as I did this time. <laughs>